Hello everyone and welcome back to Miss Cheryl's Place. Today I come to you with a video that is a Christmas tag. I'm so excited to do this tag because I absolutely love Christmas. I'm all things Christmas. So sit back and enjoy. I'm going to answer these 10 questions that um, the host of the tag, which is my Christmas style and traditions tag 2018 hosted by uh, at home with Zane. He has left us with 10 questions. I love the fact that it's an open invite um, and I'm getting ready to participate in that. So sit back and enjoy the answers to these questions. Also in advance, I apologize. I'm using my selfie stick off of my cell phone um, at the time because my tripod has somehow gotten messed up. So on to these questions. It says, what is your Christmas decor style? Modern, traditional, farmhouse, nautic, glam, or other? Okay, I'm so many different ways, like I've said about my uh, fall things, uh, decorating with fall tags. Because the reason why I say that is because one area of my home will be traditional. Another part of my home will be... Um, I want to say it will be not glam, but because of the silver and the gold sparkly, I guess that would kind of be glamish. So I, I'm, I'm a variety. That would be the answer to that question for me. It says, number two, question number two, when do you begin decorating for Christmas or have you already begun? Now, there was a time that I started decorating on um, Thanksgiving Day. We would put our tree up. And we would decorate, you know, my husband would start with the outside things. But this year I've started a little bit early. I haven't decorated quite yet. As you see, there is a tree behind me and I'm sitting in my living room. And so um, right now I have two trees up. One is also in my bedroom. And then I have the tree that's sitting here behind me in my living room. So... I've actually not decorated those trees yet. I just put them up. And I have four more trees to go. So I do six trees. So yeah, um, pretty much the answer to the question is, is that I semi-started. Question number three is, how many trees do you put up and where do you place them? Well, I pretty much just pre-answered that question. I put up six trees. Uh, one will go in my dining room. One will go in my living room. One will go in my den one in my son's room, one in my daughter's room, and one in our room. So that's six trees. We put up six. Now question number four, what is your favorite room or space to decorate for Christmas? I would have to say, and I say this with great love, is the den. Because that's where we all gather at, we all hang out, we all chill, you know, the den, the family room in, in other terms. It would be my favorite space because I just love that space. It's pretty big and yeah, it would be my it would be my favorite place to decorate. Then my second favorite place, although that's not a question, would be my kitchen. Because I feel like the kitchen is the heart of the home and I feel like that's where I spend a lot of my time. So anything to decorate and pretty up my kitchen, love it. Uh question number five. Do you listen to Christmas music or watch any Christmas movies while decorating? If so, what style of music or what movies do you listen to or watch? Okay. My style of music is soulful Christmas, uh, traditional Christmas music. I love, uh, you know, modern, which is, you know, R&B music for Christmas. I love all of it. I actually love all Christmas music because, once again, I am all things Christmas. Do I watch... Um, the second part of this, do I watch um, Christmas movies? And if so, what style of music will I answer that? Or what movies do you listen to or watch? My favorite, my family's favorite movie, and this is so funny to us, is because we just literally watched it last night, is National Lampoon's Christmas. We all love that movie. And then there's the Disney's um, the Grinch That Stole Christmas. The one with Jim Carrey in it, that movie. We love Polar Express. We watch all of the cartoons 
that I grew up with, my husband grew up with, my children grew up with, and my grandchildren are now growing up with. So yes, we, we're very involved in anything Christmas. I love it. I love the Hallmark Channel. The very first time they put on a Christmas movie, I'm there. And I have so many Christmas movies recorded on my DVR. It's ridiculous. So yeah, we're very, very, very involved at Christmas. Do you decorate outside for Christmas? Yes, we do. Um, I may do the, what I actually do, and this is so funny. Um, me and my husband discuss the way things are going to go. And mostly it's because of what I say that he's the architect in the home. But we're the ones that, me and my girls are the ones that's like, no dad or no hun. Put it over here. No boo, put it over there. So we have to have him submit to us. Um, when it comes to outside decorating. And yes, we most definitely decorate outside. Um, question number seven. Do you send out Christmas cards? Yes, I do. Once again, all things Christmas. And I may start this year because usually I wait a, maybe the first week of December. But I think I'm going to start on the week of Thanksgiving and start sending out Christmas cards this year. Okay, do you, question number eight, do you have any special Christmas traditions? Yes, we do. Um, this is a tradition that's been going on for 34 years. On Christmas Eve, I um, we do a grab bag. And on Christmas Eve, to settle the, the, and the happiness and the anxiousness of Christmas for the children, um, I did this with my children, and my oldest is 34, so 34 years. I want to say 32 to be fair because she wouldn't have really known what Christmas was about. So about 32, 31 years ago, um, we started. We actually started when she was first born, but for her realization would have been about 31 years ago. I want to give it. And what we did was um, we, um, we started a grab bag tree. And what we did was, is on Christmas Eve, we allowed the children on Christmas Eve to open a grab bag gift to settle down their anxiousness to not go to bed or, you know, when you needed them to go to sleep because everybody's anticipating Christmas and Santa coming. So, yeah, we do. That's a tradition that we do. There's another tradition that we just started about four years ago, and that is, is that we wear pajamas. We do Christmas holiday pajamas on Christmas Eve as well as their gift. So we let them open up their uh, pajamas prior to the Christmas tree, uh, grab bag tree gift. Because we want everybody in pajamas Christmas Eve. And they have to be Christmas Eve pajamas. And then this year we're getting ready to start a tradition. And in that tradition this year we will wear, because we usually get dressed up on Christmas, you know. But we all decided this year we wanted to be laid back and comfortable. We're still going to do our Christmas Eve pajamas, but we're going to wake up on Christmas Eve and we're going to open our presents, eat brunch, and then we're going to change into our Christmas pajamas for the day because we're going to wear Christmas pajamas this year for a whole day. We're not dressing up. We're just going to do a laxy daisy Christmas. Okay. Um, question number nine. Do you change your Christmas decor from year to year? Actually, I do. But there's one room that absolutely stays the same. Well, actually two, which is my kitchen. Those colors have remained the same. Um, and my den. Because I don't change the colors on that. It's traditionally decorated. But it's more of a... I want to say the, this year it's going to be more... Well, in past years I've done it log cabinish. I call it log cabinish decorating. Um... But I pretty much decorate it that way. It's woodsy and it, it has the rustic stuff. It has the farmhouse stuff. It's gorgeous. And it, yeah, so yeah, this um, will be the first year I put a tree in our bedroom. But yeah, that color is n it's so far off my spectrum that it doesn't make sense. You'll see what I'm talking about later on. But anyway, yes, we do. Um, I tend to say, yes, I can change some decor from year to year. Question number 10. I'm so, oh my goodness, it was short questions. It didn't take that long. Did you or do you plan to purchase any new Christmas de decor this year? Absolutely. I, I buy new decor every year for Christmas. Every year, it, it may be the same red. It may be, you know, it may be red and traditional decor. It may be 
the gold and the silver. It may be, um, you know, green and emerald gray, all of that. Yes, I absolutely do. I absolutely do. And I absolutely have started um, doing more Christmas um, decor, buying more of those things, purchasing more, I should say. And that is the end to these questions. I would like to thank um, At Home with Zane for his um, open Christmas tag. I absolutely enjoyed participating in this. And I am so anxious and looking forward to the new holiday coming up. Thanksgiving will be celebrated. That is our grateful time. We are very happy and blessed. We have, you know, we, we're all still here. Um, and we're grateful for that. And then we look forward to Christmas um, coming and doing the things that we do traditionally. So, again, I would like to thank At Home with Zane for open invitation for this um, tag. And I appreciate it. It's beautiful. Also, I would like to say thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And I would appreciate it if you are new to my channel and you like what you've thus far seen that you subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you'll be updated and keep abreast or kept abreast of the things that I will be posting. Um, I'm getting ready to get started with some decor and I'm taking down my fall thing slowly because I don't want to really rush it into it, but I'm going to get started with some decorating and I just can't wait to start sharing those videos. Once again, thank you very much for watching. And I appreciate you, and I love you guys. Um, make sure that you stay tuned because this is going to be a beautiful seasonal holiday coming up. And once again, I'd like to say thank you. I appreciate you. And thanks for watching. And thanks for coming by Miss Shaw's place. Know that you're always welcome here. Always. Have a blessed day.